Electric eels definitely produce enough voltage to ruin your day. Do you know that electric eels are not the only fish that produce electricity? The elephant trunk fish also produces electricity, but the thing is, is that it doesn't produce enough to actually, you know, defend itself or attack prey. It literally just uses it to make like a force field around it to be able to feel what's going on in the environment around it. Let's bump it up a little bit to the torpedo fish or the electric ray which can produce upwards of 200 volts, depending on the species. It can give you quite a bit of a shock. Do you see a fish in this video? Well, if you do, you can understand why they're called stargazers, because when they're looking up from the sand, they're staring straight up at the stars. They can produce about 50 volts, but also have a poisonous spine. Then we got this ugly sucker, the electric catfish. They can produce up to 450 volts. We're getting up there. So far away from the electric eel at 